Good evening. It is time for another unboxing. This time it is the Cards Against Humanity midterm pack, which I just got. Uh, I really like the packaging for this, so I thought I'd show it off. One cool thing they did about this, this is Cards Against Humanity uh, hacks the election. And so if you ordered this pack and you were in one of the places where there was a, like a high value election, you got it for free. Uh, I did not, but if you recommend a person who lives in one of those places, you get a pack for free. Uh, turns out I know some people in places where the election matters. So first, it comes with this awesome Cards Against Humanity Hacks the Election sticker packet, and those who know me know I love stickers, so I'm pretty excited about this sticker pack. And then we have the actual pack itself, the midterm pack. I just like the three sets here, the way that it's packaged. Now, normally I don't curse on this channel, but Cards Against Humanity curses a lot and I've decided that I'm just gonna read them as is. So be prepared, there will be cussing. We're going to start with the white cards because there's only two black cards in this pack. Total ineffective political satire. Not thinking about children in cages. 41 million Americans living in poverty. A law that allows factories to dump toxic waste into children's mouths a living wage and affordable health care, fucking over future generations, and Donald Trump's latest fucking thing. Next. Overturning Roe v. Wade, ICE, crowdfunding my daughter's bone marrow transplant, a politician who doesn't blow monkey ass, and pseudo-intellectual centrist bullshit. And our final packet here. Fentanyl, rising to power on a wave of ethnic nationalism, propping up Ruth Bader Ginsburg's corpse and moving her jaw up and down. Sean Spicer, I don't know how to say this guy's name. Renis Priebus, mm, I should know that, I don't. Steve Bannon, Sebastian Gorka, Omarosa, Anthony Scaramucci, James Comey, Mike Flynn, Rex Tillerson, Ty Cobb, Andrew McCabe, KT McFarland, HR McMaster, Gary Cohn, Hope Hicks, Rob Porter, Scott Pruitt, and Tom Price. And of course, the two black cards. If Mike Pence could dream, he would dream about blank. And what will finally make me care? So there you have it, ladies and gentlemen. That is the Cards Against Humanity Hacks the Election Midterm Pack. Hope you enjoyed that. I always enjoy these cards and I have really enjoyed how political this company has become recently and how much, you know, they're trying to work towards an agenda that I personally agree with. So hope you enjoyed that. If you like Cards Against Humanity, you should definitely check out a pack or the main pack and I'll see you tomorrow.